透明嘅，咁我可以望到出面，跟住又又唔使。好啊 ，Hello， 大家好。但我唔係幾識透明嘅。我哋啱啱喺邊度飲茶啊？我哋。利敦道。利敦道好好食。利敦酒店。利敦酒店啊！咁今日咧，我諗住誒趁呢個機會，因為我哋而家喺旺角啦。咁我就諗住去，哦，要套嘢，等我陣先嚇。咁啊唔會有塵咯，同埋佢咪望到出面咯。係啊，哇，好勁喎呢個 B B。誒咁啊係咪？係咯，今日嘅主題就係去買嗰個麥咯要，因為咧我同埋尋日撈呢個 video 咧落個 MacBook 嗰陣時咧。係太過濛啦，啲啲聲太過沙啦，咁所以咧，係而家喺旺角要買嗰啲麥啊，希望會即係個 quality， 個 sound quality 會好啲咯。其他幾多人？其他嗰度？係嘛？介紹下你而家食緊啲咩啊？呢個誒，易信啊，叫做易信嘅易信雙皮奶。嚇！佢一間好舊嘅老字號，我好細個佢已經有啦。係嘛？跟住後屘係裝修過啦，但依然都係咁好食嘅生意。我哋知啊，係好有奶味咯，呢個係。一路講。最出名生意。嚇！哇！我哋幾時到啊？呢、这個好有奶味咯，呢、这個。佢一啲都唔膠噶，你好多咧出去買嗰啲生皮啊，佢好膠嗰啲質地咧，粗粉嘅。Hey guys, um, so I was just in the middle of a vlog yesterday and um, saw something that really threw me off. Um, so I was walking down um, Mokok yesterday and I saw a shop <coughs> called Ivory. It was just simply called Ivory and it sold Ivory. And um, that reminded me of a very important documentary that I watched. Um, couple of months back and um, that reminded me of that documentary and it made me so sad so frustrated about things that really happening around this world uh, because I just think that you know we as human beings uh, we don't really give a shit about other animals uh, we just think about ourselves um, so let me talk to you about uh, that documentary. Uh, one thing that really struck me was uh, this elephant called Satel. Now Satel, his, um, the reason why he was so famous uh, back in Kenya, he was in Kenya, um, he was the oldest uh, elephant uh, in his time. And um, he was 45 years old and uh, he has a nickname called the Tusker. Now Tusker uh, the reason why he called the tusker is because his tusk was so long that uh, it could touch the ground, okay? And he was considered the icon of Kenya. No, sorry, the icon of, yeah, well, the icon of Kenya. And so 
um, obviously his ivory was uh, very precious. Uh, one of his uh, tusk weighs about 45 kilograms. Okay, so it was valuable um, in in the in the market. Okay, um, and so he was under protection, of course, by the uh, by the wildlife cons conservation. And um, one day he was shot by a couple of poison arrows. Yeah, so he was shot by a couple of poison arrows, but he survived. That's the good thing, he survived. For the next several days, he got fucking poached by one of those um, ivory poachers, okay? Now here's a picture of the towel. Gracious animal, magnificent animal. And look at what the poachers did, okay? Fucking unbelievable. He was killed because of greed, because of stupidity. Okay? The whole ivory market was fu is fueled, still fueled, by the Chinese market. Okay? People think that having ivory in their houses are a symbol of great status, you know? It's, it's, it's stupid. It's fucking stupid. Um, and that made me so sad because we as human beings think that everything, oh, you know, we are uh, very industrialized. Everything is so convenient, but at what cost though? What is the cost of having all of this? Look around you, you know? We don't care about the environment anymore. We lay waste on everything that stands in our way. We cut down forests, we don't care about their habitat, we don't care about the air pollution, we don't care, we don't care. We dump chemical, toxic chemicals down to the river and the villagers suffer. You know, take, take um, for example, genes, take genes for example. Those dye in the blue denim, they're very toxic. They contain chrome, um, chromium I think, and they poison the villagers downstream. And the media never covers that. Take, for example, um, well, H and M, a very large corporation. It's a corporation that sells clothes. Okay, cheap clothes. They push out 20 plus seasons per year, and for what? And for you to to, to buy? They they always say, oh, they always have this massive, you know, uh, marketing saying that, oh, you are out of date. You know, you need to buy this and that you need to buy this and that but at what cost though who is manufacturing all these clothes it is the people in bangladesh with horrible work conditions but they don't they never ever cover that they had they have this lady um forgot her name but he's the she's the head of sustainability and when she was attacked by this question she was fucking speechless. She knew there was a problem, but she she won't address it because it's undressable, unaddressable. Um, and so, because of the people in Bangladesh with horrible conditions, so that you can buy cheap clothes. Um, it's a sad world that we live in, and uh, we should, you know, I guess, be more aware of things that are happening around us and. And um, yeah, um, I have nothing more to say, but I will leave you with this quote. It, this is a quote from the Salvo Trust, uh, which is in Kenya. They're responsible for uh, protecting the wild, wildlife, especially the elephants uh, in Kenya. And he said this, he quoted, It is with enormous regret that we confirm that there is no doubt that Satao is dead killed by an ivory poacher's poisoned arrow to feed the seemingly unsatiable demand for ivory in off in far off countries. A great life was lost so that someone far away can have a trinket on their mental peace. Rest in peace, old friend, you will be missed. Think about it. Think about it.